All right, what is up guys, TK here, and today we are playing this game that looks almost exactly like PUBG. It is called Rules of Survival, and this is a mobile game, which is pretty sick. And let's, sh I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you what it's like. It's really interesting and it's a lot different. So you can do the solo, the duo, and the squad. There's no first person, and you can't really, you can pick your server, but not really. There's not a huge choice. Um, you click auto match up here, no auto match. And that's, it kind of like ranks you off of like how well you're doing in the game. I don't know a whole lot about this game. I just downloaded it the other day. I thought, hey, you know what? It'd be cool to get a mobile PUBG game. Check it out. See how it's doing. Look down at the bottom. There's a chat. I guess a ton of stuff is going on. You can have a mic in this game. You can talk with your squad or your, uh, your other teammate in the game if you do a duo. Um, so right here, let's click, I think. Yeah, we just click ret. No, I don't want to do a duo. So we can we can go back. Uh, I don't know what just happened. All right, so we are doing a duo. If you saw, we just jumped in. We we logged into the game. This is how it worked. Since it is a um, a mobile game, the cool thing is that at the top it will show you who's running in a certain direction, which is is kind of nice, but not really. Um, the 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 punch is kind of right in the way of your. Uh, of like what you want to like move your camera which is kind of annoying I have to put my finger up here above which I don't like uh, the cool thing is it, um, is that you can hold run and then you can let go and it will auto run so basically just kind of like in the game but you have to hold it first and then I can punch left punch right you know whatever I can jump I can uh, crouch and it's kind of just like PUBG, you get in this plane here, you know, you go across the map and then you jump out. And then it doesn't, this bottom doesn't open up like in PUBG. So what you can do is you can click on the map up here and it will show you, you can zoom in. And then you can also like, you know what, click on a place right here. That's where we're going to land. We're going to try to land over there. So we can move ourselves, and you and you looks like I'm falling really fast. Maybe I'll land there. Let's head over to these like. Uh, it's really hard to control. Oh man, I thought those were like three little huts, but they're not. Oh man, there's a guy right next to us. This is really hard. What is happening? So it's not the best. So, what's he what's he doing? Come on man. Um I'm dead. It's a really interesting game. Oh I'm being revived. Why am I why am I moving? What what the heck man? So about your gear, you can't pick your gear, your your gear goes up here, and then to see your gear uh, a little easier you click down here where this little like helmet thing is you click on that and then it will show you all the gear that you have uh, what you have on your character and then what your character is holding so that's really cool I like that I think it's cool but there's just like a few things in the game you know it's probably a new game like I said before it's not that great but for starters and for for what it gives it's um it's pretty good it's not really really bad there are a few things that are really bad about it. I was playing the other day and um, was having like a really hard day and my game kept like glitching and everybody was like shooting at me but I couldn't move like a certain distance out of position. It was really frustrating. So that's one of the downfalls of the game. So here I'll show you how it works. You just click on the stuff like you do in the game. And then you click on the bullet here, and it will reload your gun. And uh, let's see what do we got. Ooh, a red dot sight. And the nice thing about these is that they directly go onto your weapons. You don't have to like pick and choose what they go to. Oh, there's a person. Oh man, this game is really crazy. They didn't have anything. That's weird though that it says their heritage. And so that's how you know it's not like the box on the floor in PUBG. There's these like cubes just floating around, which I think is really weird. 
And then you can pick up here at the top if you can see where the gun is. It says auto to single. And so I think that's pretty cool. Um, maybe it didn't put the red dot sight on my gun for me. Let's see. Oh, it didn't. Usually it does, so that's weird. What the heck is going on? Oh yeah, you can't have a... You can't have a, a dot sight on the Tommy gun, which is weird, I think. It'd be really nice if you could. Oh look, a, a guy died over here. Hopefully we don't die. So you have this eye here. I don't know how it works, but you're supposed to be able to look around without moving your camera. Not sure 100% how it works yet. Not really a huge ton explanatory in this game. And you just kind of jump in and hopefully you figure it out. There are cars in this game you can get like... What was it, like a monster truck I had the other day? It was really weird. I was like, what the heck is going on? I think it's a boat. No, it's a log. Never mind. Maybe it's just my eyes. Me playing PUBG on my PC and playing PUBG. Oh, here we go. Oh, I can see it. Maybe there's a guy over here. Oh, look at that. There's a few of them over here. It's like a lot of people died over here. So if you look up at the top, it says somebody was knocked out accidentally. I don't know how you get knocked out accidentally. Just, that's what I'm just thinking. That's all I can hold. Here we go. Nope. Where the heck was this guy? We didn't too, do too bad. We got place 300, I mean 33 out of 119. And the interesting thing is in this game is it can go up I think to 120 is the max. And then in regular PUBG it's 100. Alright guys, thanks so much for watching. If you did like this video, please do not forget to hit that like button. If you want to know what's going on when I am posting new videos and what's going on in my life, check out my Instagram, it will be down in the description. Also, I have set up a Patreon. Go check it out if you guys want to help donate to my channel so I can keep making more sick videos for you guys. Also, I do have a Teespring for some t-shirts that I'm doing. I've set up a few more uh, other t-shirt ideas and you guys can go check those out and help donate to my channel. Alright guys, I am TK and you guys have a sick day. Peace out.